the worst. But don't be daunted by their numbers. Heed my yeah, fellas. All will end well. Hey, you men down there. Tell the people outside Welcome the walls to prepare Kingdom for attack. Deliverance. Quickly, do you understand? This is Raptor Jesus saying good morning, fellers. What's going on? I don't know. It doesn't make sense. Why would Sigismund exactly. advance on Talmud in the night? Especially since he's lost the element of surprise after the raid on Scalots. Maybe it's not him. Then who is it? The scouts Jivish sent to Scalots to spy on Sigismund said he'd set up camp and was getting ready to storm the castle. And so Radzig is an experienced soldier. He'd surely hold the castle for quite some time. It doesn't make sense. What else did the spies say? Not much of anything. Before they could get close enough, this huge storm started. And you were right. Sigismund has a hell of a lot of soldiers, including all manner of mercenaries. An army like that costs a fortune. Well, anyway, we'll find out when they get here, won't we? Aye, we will. I'll be with you. Lucifer and all his minions! Who else, Robert? Sir Radzig! What a relief! Is his lordship there with you? Yes, sir, he is right here. What are you doing up so late, Divish? At your age, you need a good night's sleep. <laughs> well, Radzig, you didn't exactly pick the best time for an outing either. In a big hurry? It was a bit of a scramble, all right. Believe it or not, this tempest is a godsend for me and my men. As my old granddad used to say, better a sore throat than a slick throat. I'd say your grandfather was a wise man. Your messenger told us what happened. Messenger? The lad you sent to warn us. He's alive? He made it to you? He's here with me. He only got away by the skin of his teeth, though. Thank God. A brave young man. But tell me, friend, how on earth did you manage to get away? Thank God for this tempest. When it began, Sigismund's Tatars crawled into their holes and left a storm in the castle for more clement weather. We were able to sneak out right under their noses. The Lord be praised. We wouldn't have stood a chance against them. Would you like to spend the night in Tumber? No, no. When Sigismund finds the castle empty tomorrow, he might come looking for us. We'd only be exposing you to danger. Without me and my men, he has no call to attack you. Well, what will you do then? We'll march to Ratai. It's only a short way, and there we'll have a better chance of defense and enough room for all of these people. If Sigismund should come, better bend your knee, Poor Divish. Bastards. There's no point dying in a battle that's futile. You're right there. Is that boy still with you? I'm here, sir. You have courage, lad. That I can't deny. I am sorry about what happened. Would you care to join us? I'd like to, sir, but first I have to return to Scalitz. Are you mad? What do you want there? I can't leave my mother and father. I won't leave their corpses rotting in the street. I'll join you once I've taken care of them. Don't even think of going back there, you donkey. Are you tired of living? But sir! Quiet! <laughs> I'm sorry about your father, but getting killed as well won't help him. Divish? Make sure that lad doesn't budge from Talmberg until things quieten down. Not to worry, friend. Anyway, he's injured and needs to recover. I'll lock him up here as if he were Havel of Baldic. I've seen you've grown a thick skin since your tribulation, sir. But thank you. We'll meet again when circumstances are more favorable. Farewell. Farewell, friend, and good fortune. Give my regards to Sir Hanish. I will. And good so luck to you and your people, too. Colors. These are dark times. Move out! Anywhere, people! Move out! Lucky the storm came so those fellers could escape, guys. Men, 
Tonight we'll have triple patrol. Sort out the watches between you as always. And if I catch anyone boozing, playing dice or slacking off, I'll personally break every bone in his body. I want you to keep a close eye on everything nearby. Sigismund will surely have sent spies, and likely men as well, to follow the Scalas people now he knows they've fled. Keep your eyes peeled and report everything to me at once. Understood? They put their torches out for that purpose. What is it you need? <laughs> I could use an extra pair of eyes, and yours are keen. Will you keep watch on the battlements with my men? Is that a request or an order? I'd rather it was a request you answered yesterday. Of course I'll help. I'll have to pay you back somehow after all you've done for me. Splendid. And don't worry. I'll tell the men to relieve you later. I'll be with you. Now, this is the funny thing about playing on a hardcore mode. There's no quest markers, so I actually don't know where I'm supposed to stand. It's dark out there, fellas. <laughs> I guess I'll just walk around. That's what you do when you're on watch, right? <laughs> oh, look, once you can see, once there's a torch down there, it's actually pretty easy to see. It's pretty cool graphics. This game has really good graphics, even though I'm playing on my PS4. I wish I had all the DLCs, I just grabbed the base game for like two bucks or something on a sale. I was supposed to go up there, that looks like a private place. Try not to fall off the stairs here, fellas. Wandering around like a stray sheep. Must be your first watch, eh? I don't think anything much will be happening today. You can just <laughs> lean against the wall and wait till morning. I'll show you what's what. I will. Thank you. This guy had to go look for me, so I was just wandering around like an idiot. <laughs> it's good that everyone does that on their first watch, so I'm not a total idiot, I'm just a newbie. <laughs> Try not to do something stupid like this on my second watch at least, so I don't get a reputation as the idiot guard. <laughs> Which wall am I supposed to lean on? Is there a designated wall? <laughs> That's it. I thought this guy was gonna leave me, but maybe he's just like walking around. Uh, That's what we do on the watch. This wall. I guess. Alright. It's over here. Good health to you. What do you think about how the Scalets folk managed to flee the siege? Thank the so Lord. Just do some I thought it was Sigismund descending on us. It seems everyone thought that. <clears throat> well, we were all expecting the worst. And the truth is, I'm still worried what will happen when Sigismund comes here. And come he will, of that I'm sure. I just hope we'll be as fortunate when we're face to face with that fucker. By the way, Henry, my condolences. Thank you. May the Lord watch over you. I don't know if this small castle can hold against this army. All citizens would be just Jesus fucking Christ be praised. Wanted to invade, fellas. What do you think about the flight of the Scullers, folk? I'd say Sir Rodzik is a fine lord. He made the most of the situation and saved his subjects. You don't see that very often. He was lucky that big storm came. But that's just it. Something happens by chance and you turn it to your advantage. There's not many capable of thinking so fast. 
Take care now. You gotta be quick on your feet to survive out in these ancient times, fellas. And a wit, I suppose, too. I have no idea where I'm gonna stand, so... I guess I'll just wait. Maybe even place it on that one, too. <laughs> What do you fellows think? So the military is sometimes in a very open way. Let's go! Let's go! Move it! Quick! Go! Go! Let's go! Let's go! Move it! Quick! Go! Go! Fun begins, fellas. Indeed, Rovard. Sigismund of Luxembourg has a rare talent for winning people over to his cause. You may be in for a surprise. I don't think he will set his heathen die, dogs on us. <laughs> Greetings, Lord of Tomberg. Jeez. That's the bastard who let the attack of Scarlet and kill my parents. An idiot! Do you want to end up like them? I am Sir Mark Vart von Aulitz. I come in the name of Sigismund of Luxembourg, King of Hungary and Croatia, who has resolved to strike against those who disrupt Concord in the land and to restore order in the name of his brother, King Wenceslaus IV. Restore order? by burning and pillaging the king's estates. <laughs> Greetings, Sir Markvard. The efforts of the king's brother to bring order to this chaotic land are undoubtedly noble. It seems to me, though, that he and his army have somewhat strayed. As Burgrave of Prague Castle, I am entirely beholden to the king, and here in Talmberg, divine peace reigned until your arrival. To what then do we owe the honor of your visit? <laughs> Yesterday, His Majesty took action against the enemy of the talker. kingdom, the Ratzik Kobila, who has been using the silver from the Scarlet's mine to fund insurrection against the crown. Unfortunately, the insurgent escaped. Would you happen to know, noble sir, where he might be at this time? As far as I know, the Sir Radzik, of which you speak, is the king's hetman at Scarlet's. I find it hard to imagine that he would rebel against our king. Nevertheless, I can assure you that Sir Radzik is not a Talmud. He would be a fool indeed to flee from one castle, where he has little chance of defense, to another, where he has even less. Or do you take the view that my humble manner is any obstacle to your army? Am I to inform the king then that Zeratsi Kobila is not a Tamburg and that he has your loyalty? Sir Radzig Kobila is not here, and I have no intentions of getting embroiled in affairs from which I have nothing to gain. Very well, sir. As you wish. I will relay your words to the king in the hope he will be as well disposed as you seem to be. Those who have clean consciences and goodwill may find themselves well disposed even at moments like this, when there is little cause for joy. Farewell, sir. Auf Wiedersehen. us. 
enough of a smooth talker. Oh, no wonder he's a redhead. That explains everything, fellas. That explains everything. My lord, you have my sense. Get on with you, Robard. How do I get that level of speech, fellers? That was quite harrowing. We survived another day, eh? Oh, fellas, that's my video. I hope you liked it and you commented down below if you had any suggestions, alright? I hope you're subscribed to my channel because it really helps me out with the feeding the algorithm gods. But you guys have a good game next time, alright? And keep your shield on strong, alright?